Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial, and today it's on the plugin Bottled Experience. So, this is a really awesome plugin which allows your players to exchange their experience into bottles of experience. And uh, there's a few ways they can do this. They can either do it via a command, doing bottle and then an amount of experience they want. Um, so, for example, 10 bottles. Um, but obviously, we do need. Um, empty bottles so let's go ahead and give myself that uh, which is 374 I believe um, and then we can do it so yeah there we go so as you can see that gave me um, 10 more bottles of experience and it took it out of my experience bar now we can also right click um, a particular block which I've set as emerald um, by default it's an enchantment table uh, with 374 a glass bottle and that will also take it out of the uh, experience bar which is really, really cool. So if you do forward slash bottle, which is uh, the main command, it shows you how much experience you have and what level you are. And then if you do bottle until, followed by a level such as 50, it will tell you how much experience you need and how many bottles are required to get to that level. If you do forward slash bottle and then max, that will um, take as much experience as it can using all the um, bottles you have, so as you can see I've got no more bottles left, so I better give myself some more, uh, like that, which is really, really cool, uh, so let me give myself a bit more, like that. There are a few more commands, such as bottle, give, a player's username, uh, obviously not yourself, and then you can actually send people experience, which is really, really cool. Um, I haven't seen another plugin that's done this, but uh, this plugin is really awesome, and you can download it for free on Spigot. Uh, so yeah, there is quite a lot in the config file which we will be heading into. Um, before we go in, you can obviously do bottle reload and that reloads everything in the config file. And as you can see, some of the options pop up in chat just to show you what has been changed and whatnot. Um, so yeah, I believe that is everything in um, in game. Uh, you can obviously disable uh, this right clicking method. Um, but yeah, let's go into the config file now and show you what you can change. So here we are in the config file. As you can see, there is quite a lot you can edit. So um, at the bottom is all the text. You might want to change some colors or some of the ways it's worded, but that's um, pretty all right. I would leave it alone if I were you. Up here, this is the important stuff. So um, as you can see, this is what I was talking about in game. This is the emerald block. So if you right click that, um, it will take off um, a glass bottle. So that's pretty awesome. Um, and up here as well, the consumed item is um, when you do the command. You can obviously disable that. So if you do the command, it won't take off this bottle. And the amount is obviously one. So that's pretty awesome that you can change that. You can also uh, use money as well and bottle money. But um, I don't know, I'd prefer not to use that if I were you. I'd just stick with experience. Um, you, you can also uh, turn on show enchant to true as well. So it explains what everything is up here, which is very, very useful. So uh, XP cost is how much the player will spend converting his experience. Um, so yeah, it's a really awesome plugin. You can change all these values to whatever you want. And yeah, so um, that's pretty much it. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.